We do want to say good morning. Glad you're waking up with us. I'm Ira Cronin. And I'm Bree Groves. And we do start with that breaking news that we mentioned live on the scene of an officer involved shooting. This happened last night off Foot Avenue. That's just a couple blocks north of the Olympic Training Center here in Colorado Springs. And News 5's Devin Karp is live there on the scene. And Devin, what do we know about all of this so far? Well, as you can see behind me, still very active of a scene. We have the crime lab that just pulled up to do some of their analysis. Now we're still figuring out more information. The sheriff's office has taken over for CSPD on this case since the officer involved shooting happened. We do know that last night around 530 PM, police were called here for a domestic disturbance. Now when police got here, they learned that the suspect was hiding inside of the house with the caution tape up. When officers went inside, they gave the man verbal commands, but he refused to listen. Now they did try to use a taser, but it did not work and they said it was not effective. At one point, at least one officer fired a gun hitting the suspect. The suspect was taken to the hospital. We have no information on the suspect or their condition. No officers were injured. The CSPD officer has been placed on administrative leave and the El Paso County Sheriff's Office will now be investigating. So we're still waiting to hear some of this information. In fact, we've already seen some of these neighbors come out of their homes asking CSPD some questions. We're still waiting to hear in for more information as it develops. But for right now, reporting in Colorado Springs, I'm Devin Karp, News 5.